Hi, this is Darcy from Lumos Learning. Today, I will demonstrate how to use Lumos Guided Practice to help students in grade eight develop conceptual understanding for specific topics in math. The Lumos Guided Practice is an intelligent, artificial intelligence-powered conversational system that offers students with individualized practice in an empathetic environment. Like a teacher, it carefully learns from the students' proficiency data and significantly simplifies the user's experience. It also offers lessons that are precisely tailored to the students' unique needs and provides interactive voice and visual aids to motivate and engage learners. Let's dive right into Lumos Guided Practice and see it in action. Once you open up the free guided practice module on the Lumos Learning website, you'll need to select the grade and the subject for which you want to practice questions. Here are the domains for grade eight math. For today's demonstration, I will be choosing the domain called the number system. All of the questions are standards aligned, dynamic and support independent practice. Let's select the first one. Simply click on the play button to get started. Find the correct decimal form of 36 divided by 10. Note round up to two decimal values and Bob considers x.0 and x is different, where x can be any integer value. For example, if your answer is 3 then please enter it as 3.0. The Lumos assistant reads out the question. If you're not sure of the answer and need some extra support, click on the hint button over here. To find the decimal representation divide 36 by 10. Nice! With the help of this hint, you can try arriving at an answer. To respond via voice, simply click the mic button here, or enter your answer in the text box and click Submit. It is 3.6 here is how I got. 36 divided by 10 equals 3.6. Would you like to try another problem similar to this? Uh-oh, looks like your answer is wrong and you need some more practice. You can refer to the detailed explanation over here. Let's practice some more questions. Well done. Good job. Would you like to try another problem similar to this? That's a right answer. You rock. What's more, at the top right, you have this settings icon which you can use to give access to the volume control slider for Lumos Assistant's voice. With these other buttons, you can hit pause, replay, mute, and even control the playback speed of the audio narration. Isn't this super cool and easy? I hope you loved Lumos Guided Practice. Head over to the Lumos Learning website, select grade and subject of your choice, and try it for free.